Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying something very new to us. These are Fun Sweets brand. This is Cotton Candy Shake-Ons, powered by uh, Warheads. This is the Sour Watermelon. Out of the Sour Blue Raz. And they, they're not cheap. They were $4 a piece. Yeah, which is a little crazy. Um, so let's see, it says. So they have a plastic seal around it, so that's nice. How best to enjoy shake-ons. Shake the sour flavoring on the candy while it's in the tub. You get three. Flavor one layer at a time. Only shake on a little bit till you know how much you want. This says there's three servings. One ounce, 28 grams is 110 calories. Mine has two, two three servings? Yep, three servings. Mine says two servings, oh. one ounce is 110. Three servings, one ounce is 110, 28 grams. Mine's two, one ounce, 28 grams. Well, guess what? One of these must, has to be wrong. It has to <laughs> You be. would think so. Well, I mean, sir, how about your container? Mine's three ounces. Yours is 3.2. So something's wrong. They, they've just said, they should have said three on that one, I bet. Okay, so you open this up, and then you get these. I got three packets, just like you did. Okay, so now it's saying, just shake it in top. there. Yeah. Oh, I got. But I think you should place. try out a little bit oh, before. Oh, okay, because it's supposed it to taste like. like sour watermelon. That's a good idea. I bet you the sour watermelon though comes from the shaker, not from the cotton candy. Mm-mm. It's the cotton candy. Mm, the watermelon's here. Yes, that tastes like watermelon. That is good. Mm, it's a nice sweet watermelon. Yeah, it tastes like watermelon candy. So there's the sour. Sour flavoring. It literally says sour flavoring. Okay. How ridiculous you gonna be? Some kids would want to just eat, um, just eat this. Yeah. Burn a hole in your tongue. The bad thing is, is how are you supposed to get that out of there without making a mess? We'll see. Okay. You definitely got some powder on there. Oh Lord. Oh. Sour. Oh. You did mm -hmm. put a lot. Mm-hmm. I triple dog dare you. No. Um, this is something people would make videos of. Ooh. To see if you could like eat all three of these at one time. Just put this on your tongue. Your tongue. See what? It doesn't take much. Your tongue would be burn. Um, you would burn a layer of skin off your tongue. Um, oh, you're gonna try it? Just a little bit. Just a little bit. It's literally less than a pinch of salt. To try. Yeah. It doesn't really have a flavor. It's literally just sour. <laughs> well, if you want to ruin a really good watermelon cotton candy, pour that on. Yeah, I just like the cotton candy. The cotton candy is excellent. <laughs> cotton candy is really good. Candy watermelon. Um, I'm telling you people be doing videos of this because uh, um, that would be a good dare. It would literally um, burn your tongue. I really genuinely think that you yeah, would I don't think you should do it. I do not. I know. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not saying you should. I'm saying I think it will happen whether you like it or not. Yeah, if people um, realize that's what's in there. Yes. Um, so now this is the blue rise. Where's your... Okay. Right. I'm assuming it's the same powder, but we can try to be sure. Oh gosh, that's so good. I know, that's what I'm saying. It's good cotton candy and they're ruining it with a sour stuff. That cotton candy is nice. Here, give me this. Don't yeah, me. I really like that. Don't dump it in there and ruin it. <laughs> I always like cotton candy though. And flavored cotton candy is just fun. Okay. You can pour it in there if you want to. I just didn't want to. Are you going to eat all that? No, you never. Know oh, I wonder, did you prepare that for you or for no. both of us? Wow. Good grief. You know what, though? It's actually not bad if you get just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> no. <I'll... coughs> um. That's wrong. Well, I think I got a clump of it. Um, I actually like that more. I like that sour. It translates better with sour. 
Yes, I like the sour with the blueberry more, or raspberry, blue um, rasp. I'll get it right in a minute. I like it much better with that than mm -hmm. I did on the watermelon. But for me, I think you should just eat the cotton candy because it's really, really good cotton candy. It's it's very enjoyable. The watermelon has a terrific flavor, and that blue rasp is great as well. I mean, they're sweet and um, pack a punch of flavor. They're really good. I don't know if they're worth. What was it, four dollars? It was four dollars. I don't that's know if they're worth lot. four. Maybe two dollars, maybe, mm -hmm. and that's pushing it. Um, yeah, but prices have gone up these know, days. That's probably. I'm just thinking it. the normal cotton candy you can buy the like the three pack of flavored cotton candy. Yeah, for, but I don't know how much that for is. Three or four dollars, I think. I just, don't know. I don't maybe know. More than that. Yeah, I don't know. I'd be mm -hmm. afraid. I don't know how much prices are unless we actually buy it, and so I'm things have gone up so that, much though. that I would be afraid to say. Yeah. I'm just gonna say that I don't think it's worth four dollars a piece. <laughs> I think it's a lot. Uh, yeah, these uh, because it is really good cotton candy. If you're gonna buy it for your kids, it's you're gonna be hard pressed to spend four dollars, but you'd easily spend two dollars. Right. For your kids to snack on. So just that's what I'm thinking. I, I think they're both really good. If if I was to pick one, um, I would pick the watermelon I and just too. not add the stuff to it. Yeah. And it's good. If you do buy these for your kids and you watch this video, happen to see it beforehand, they should put a warning on this stuff not to use a lot of it because it literally will hurt you. Yeah, I, I think I, I really genuinely, that's not us being prudes. That's just the no, truth. I, so really do, I really do think it would burn a layer of, and your mouth, I think, would be sore. Like mm. when you when you burn the roof of your mouth from eating a piece of pizza or something, you know, you, you feel that for hours later. I think this would hurt hours later. Yeah. Well, they say on warhead packages not to, to eat too many of them because you can uh, uh, yeah. hurt your tongue. Cause it's it's got like an acidic acid kind of. I wonder if that's on here anywhere. A warning. Uh, you would think. Fun so. sweets, pa Royal Palm Beach, Florida. They have a bunch of stuff printed down here. No, that's what I read about the directions. Shake the sour oh, flavoring. Okay. Those are the directions. So no, it is not. Oh. It's just a www.funsweets.net, oh, um, and it just says Warheads is a registered trademark. Now but Andrew would just take that and pour it in his mouth because he's crazy. If Andrew was doing, if Andrew, our son, was here doing the review with us, he would have totally done that. But I need my taste buds. I need to be on point, so I'm not going to That's ruin right. them. Yeah, it. but the cotton candy itself is really good. Yeah, you'll like it. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.